everybody uh, here at the our local 99 cent store we are about to look for some Tupperware and see what we can find so we can start our meal prep so we got all kind of Tupperware we got these but they're a little too cheap so I'm looking for something more like like these here take them got this one it's much smaller but this might only fit my rice and not my chicken so we'll be taking this one it has three compartments and these are two for a dollar so we be taking four so that'll be eight for about five dollars with taxes Got some baby spinach and baby kale. I don't like to eat my greens, so I'm gonna juice them. What else should we get? What else? What else? Where are we going? Where are we going? Looking for the meat. We get some chicken. Like a meal prep tonight. Looking for some chicken breast. Bonus fingers for us. Keep going. Love ground beef too, but I might just get some chicken breast tonight. See what the wife thinks about these. Ground chicken. Never tried ground chicken before. 338. 298. 5% fat. Uh, tried ground turkey the other day. Did not like it at all. So never again, sticking with chicken or lean ground beef. Ninety-three-seven ground beef right here. Wow. About eleven dollars. All right, we'll see. We'll see. This chicken breast. Let's keep it going, girl. Just gonna rinse off the chicken breast. <laughs> We got this bad boy. We'll make the white rice in here and throw it in the microwave. We got this. Had to measure two cups. Um, I make three cups in this. So put it up to two cups and then put it up to one. Throw it in here. Three 
three cups. And for every cup, we gotta put two cups of water. So here's a spoon. Lock it up and just throw it in the microwave. Throw it in there. Then time cook for 21 minutes. And when it's done, it'll be ready to go and put into containers. If she's preparing my chicken breast. So what are you doing right now, baby? Um. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm um, cutting them in half. Cutting them in half? And what you do with this? Yes. All the nasty pieces. All the nasty pieces. Alright. So there's my muscles right there. Nice. Chicken is all cut up, ready to go. We'll be uh, putting them on the tray here. And they will be baked in the oven. Not fried or done on a stove. Throw them in there for how long, love? 20 minutes. 20 minutes at 400 degrees and we'll just throw a bunch of seasoning on them and yep so stay tuned this one has no salt nice it's just a bunch of spices What about these? Those are going to put on a different tray. Can you fast forward on your camera? And we got the rice in here. About 10 more minutes to go. See it bubbling in there. By the time this thing is done, it is a mess in here. Ugh. So with this seasoning, it tastes delicious. I won't go any other way. I would like to do this with the white rice and throw it in with sriracha. And that's how I eat my meals. Or either way, that's how I will be eating my meals. Just prepping for about three to four days. Oh, I don't want to have one in the refrigerator for too long. If it's nasty, then I'll be sick and I can go to the gym. And yeah, that will suck. But this way, I have no meals prepped. If I get hungry or if I get tempted to eat anything else, I know I have already meals in the refrigerator ready to just heat up. Yeah. Mm. Alright. So, well, we already set the oven to bake at 400 degrees. That'll be ready to pop in there. My wife sprays it with the spray. What spray is that? Canola oil. Take this spray. Nice. All right. So now we'll just throw it in the oven. Twenty minutes. After the 20 minutes, it's, it's done or? I turn them over halfway and then it's done. Oh, so. Or if you like it extra crispy, you can go an extra time. Nice. So basically, at 10 minutes, we'll stop it and flip them over for, and then leave it for another 10 to 15 minutes. Six more minutes on the clock for the rag. Second tray.
Maybe next time I'll do half of my meals with chicken and the other half with ground beef. Clean ground beef. So I'm go ahead and put those in the oven. So now we are going to flip them. Rice is done by the way. Look at that, look at that. See how it makes a mess on this container, but you don't have to mess with it, you just put it in there and it gets it done. There it goes, so now I'm gonna pop it back in here. Look at the other one. Nice. Take out this rice. Alright, See? Finished product. Now we're gonna put them in these trays and then wait for the chicken. We doing so one of these is a cup, so we're just gonna uh, do those uh, to them filled. And uh, you don't wanna like compact them, you just wanna like Fill it. Don't squeeze it down or anything. So there's one. And two. So here we go. Got two of them down. So if you don't like plain white rice, you can put basically anything on it. Just try to keep your calories low. Uh, I like to put sriracha in it. Uh, soy sauce, I'm trying to stay away from it because it's very high in sodium. So let's see how it goes with just sriracha and the chicken. So that's for four meals. There's still some more in there. We're going to have to wash some more of the Tupperware. We brought eight in total. so. See how many this rice can make. So my wife suggests that we put them here under the fan so they can cool down. I don't know if you can put it under the fan. Well, it doesn't have to be under the fan, but it's it'll be uh, easier for them <laughs> to cool down <laughs> because you don't want to cover them or store them until they're cool. Um, that way you don't get sick. All right, so. You can try it if you don't. Yeah, you don't have to, but that's what we're gonna do. The other two. Hopefully, it makes the whole eight. But if it doesn't, two days prep is good enough. So you see how she doesn't really compact it in, and you know as soon as it gets to the top, just should be enough. I don't want to 
overdo it and then not see results because of it so that is it so that is six I can probably get another I'll probably do another we'll try let's see what we can get so there's the one so it should do total about seven meals for the three cups of uncooked rice that we cooked so uh, three three uncooked cups of rice basically made uh, two four six eight ten twelve fourteen cups of white rice cooked nice so if you need to know that note there you go fourteen cups of white rice cooked of three cups of uncooked white rice so we got seven meals that are going to be prepped which would be about two and a third days and then i'll have my wife cook some more even better <laughs> nice look at that getting cooled down can't wait till tomorrow so our chicken is done and ready to prep look at that video cut off but like I was saying make sure you turn off your oven especially if you prep late at night make sure you don't burn your house down and depends on how you want your chicken a little crispier or not you can leave it in there a little longer make sure it's cooked to specs what else my love um wait five minutes before you mess with your chicken Five minutes. So that the chicken can reabsorb its juices. Nice. Well, you heard it. Make sure you do that. Came back to our chicken. We made sure that the rice and the chicken has cooled off. Um, that way we can uh, cover it up, get it ready, and put it away in the refrigerator. And we won't be warming them up until we are ready to eat them. So, here we go, we're just dicing them up. Uh, we're gonna put them in uh, one cup, which is eight ounces, and we'll be putting eight ounces in every meal. Okay, so we'll be filling up um, one cup. Uh, one cup so it should be about eight ounces there you go just there you go so that's how each meal is going to look pretty much delicious so because I do not like vegetables I will be uh, blending my vegetables that I will have to drink and in this third spot we'll probably be putting the lettuce but we won't put that lettuce now because it'll probably be get nasty so mm -hmm. we'll just be cutting that up as we eat our meal me? Oh, that's right. Um, my wife suggests that I uh, put <laughs> beans in there, just regular beans, not refried or anything. Um, mm -hmm. Beans do have fiber and uh, protein, so I'll be looking up how much beans uh, calories have, calories beans have, and we'll be going from there. Each meal consists of about seven to eight hundred calories, which brings me to about two thousand calories a day with the three meals. And I will be trying to drink about a gallon of water a day, which is uh, 128 ounces of water. Don't drink your calories, so try not to. Uh, drink soda or juices or anything like that. Uh, if you do drink 
soda occasionally. Just try to get it diet. You know, keep those calories out of your diet. You know, so. So the chicken breast that we bought was about four pounds. Um, that was about eight dollars. So, and uh, what is it? Five pound bag of rice costs two dollars and twenty five cents. So, let's say ten dollars. Ten dollars. And this made seven meals for about ten dollars. And you would still have more rice uh, available. So here are how our meals are going to look. Now we're going to cover them up, put them away, and I'll eat my first one tomorrow. Really? Really? You want your butt in the background? Oh, wow. Anyways. Uh, here it is. Finished product. We uh seven meals. Like I said, these seven meals were about $10 to make. That's uh, two days and a third. So when we finish, I'm gonna make some more next time. But chicken, rice. I remember the Tupperware, we did get them at the 99 cent store. They were two for dollars, so I was about $4. So if you don't wanna keep using them after a while, you can just throw them away and get some new ones. Anyways, thank you guys for watching our video. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Until next time, stay tuned. Be the beast you can be.